just here November 16th, uh, ready, ready for something big to happen. The guys keep saying I'm gonna start crying, but we already got it packed. If I start crying, they're all gonna start crying. I'll admit, I don't know much about marriage. I know the kind of marriage that mom and dad have, one based on mutual respect and support and kindness. Other than that, I turn to books and poets. Love consists in this, that two solitudes protect and touch and greet each other. I see that in you too. You don't need each other, but you want each other. You want to support the other in achieving their dreams. You want to hear about the other's day, and you want to make each other laugh. You are a part of me. I swear i I knew Trent was the one for me. Hmm. It's kind of funny, I think I've always known he was the one for me. I'd say three years ago is when I knew that she was the one. I think she knew that before me, because I still have a card from uh, May of 2014 when she wrote, Dear Future Husband. But I kind of pushed him away because he was too good of a person. <laughs> he, was, he is such a sweetheart. He has the sweetest demeanor about him. He loves me so well. And I knew the minute that, that we went to the ball together, that's when I was like, yeah, this is it. Cam, my final message to you, it's not going to be easy moving, moving away from home for you, I know. Um, and I'll be there with you every step of the way. Okay, the last thing I want to say to Trent is, first off, I love you so much and I cannot wait to be your wife. You are everything that I've prayed for and the man of my dreams. Can't wait for us to do this thing. <laughs>
Quite like this. 